Everything hurts. Except the fun bits. Greetings and hallucinations, ladies and lads. I am Chancellor of the Harmonious Frequencies of the Mighty Empire of Onion. And this is We Happy Few. Okay. Uh, we went to the magic chest and we deposited the bricks. It made us stronger, surprisingly enough. Very strange. Uh, now we are exploring around this area. The cellar here has stuff in it. Should be pretty good stuff. Uh, and then PG over here is another one that we're going to be looking for. Let's make sure that our... Oh, too far. Pituitary extractor is selected. That'll be good. Uh, huh. I thought that we had... Are knockout syringes used in tools, or are they drugs? They've got to be tools instead, right? Yeah, 29 knockout syringes. Uh, they don't display in a slot, apparently. Okay, so we can just automatically knock people out since we have them in our inventory, I guess. Just in case the pituitary extractor doesn't work. Trying not to fall too suddenly. It didn't work though. Sorry. Get out. All right. Don't think I won't sniff you out. Okay. Don't worry. We might have to sneak up on him from the side then. Oh, that guy's floating. We can try starting to pick the lock and stuff, but I don't think it'll work quite right. There we go. It's your fault for leading me on. Downed. Oh man. I don't know why my finger has to twitch like that where I press buttons too many times. <laughs> It almost looked like it went into his eyeball instead of his nostril. We'll pretend like it worked out correctly though. It's all good. Last bottle, sure. Okay, we don't want that. And we know that there's at least two or three guys down in here too, so we will have more people to take down. Why am I standing? If I remember correctly, yep, yeah, there's a guy right there too. There you go. Perfect. Nothing. Take these records and stuff. A big splinter, sure. I don't know what those are good for uh, with Sally. I imagine nothing, but I don't know for sure. Okay. Take those things. guy about to jog on. Oh, there's two dudes up there. I didn't realize that. Thought it was only the one. Okay, that guy appears to be a little bit bugged out.
Okay. Tosser is pretty good, I'd say. Is that a sandwich or something? It is. Okay. Now this guy down here should be moving around. Yeah, he's stuck for some reason. I'm sure if we hit him with a bottle or something, he would be unstuck. So we may do that. Or a rubber duck, because we get those back. Oh, did he just... He just unstuck, and then... Now he's back over where he was before. And now he's stuck again. Perfect. Perfect. I love this game's jolly quirks like this. Alright, well then. Let's just try to get them all where they're uh, going to be doing what they're supposed to do. Is he really that stuck? He's that stuck. That's stuck. Here he comes. Uh, it's a little weird that I can't just press F to select something new. I have to go and un unselect the bottles. Okay. Are they still wandering around? Kind of. Not sure how he died. It was that same weird bug uh, where I go up to take someone down and they just die immediately. Weren't there two dudes up here before? I'm sure, there were. Okay, pocket expansion kit, some spiky bricks and stuff. We're already almost back up to carry capacity here. No, we just had it expanded. Okay, so it appears that is it. Some metal bits, okay. Yeah, duct tape we need. My trusty rubber duck. Uh, let me out, please. There we go. Fantastic. Okay. Uh, yeah. Let's go hit up this dig spot first. And we'll get the other one on the way to Peachy, and then we'll grab Peachy. And we'll grab the dig spot on the other side of Peachy after that. It'll all work out in the end. Let's grab these while we're here. 
and we have a little bit of carrying space. Of course, we won't after we dig this up, I'm sure. But we can get rid of some things if we find anything incredibly useful. Uh, we're not going to know how to make these into regular gas masks, I don't think. Add a filter to make this a functioning gas mask. I don't think water filters will work. I might be wrong, but I'm sure that we don't have the recipe for a working gas mask. Yeah, we don't. Okay. So that was that. This is the next. over there as soon as we can. I'm running my stamina right down, and that's not necessarily a good idea. I need to be a little more aware. I have enough points to buy a skill. Okay. Gilead petals. Oh, there's some rowan berries. Oh, here we go. I almost ran past it. Okay, another pocket expansion kick. That's great. Uh, I don't think we need another canteen. I'm not thrilled with the berserk darts either. Um, they don't seem to be very effective. to 156 now. Wonderful. Okay. Now let's take off the custom waypoint. Let's get uh, Peachy on here. And go see what we can find this situation. Alright. Even when we're not sneaking, we seem to be less visible at night, and that is wonderful. Because I don't like having to sneak around all the time. It's a lot easier just to be running. Things you can't get away with this, Dr. Verloc. I've come to stop wow. your evil scheme. Can't ah, jump over that silly... You've fallen into my evil trap. What's going on? I can't move. Yes, Mr. Croker. It's my paralyzing ray. But wait. Here's Peachy Conahan with his special operations executive hand mirror. He reflects your paralyzing ray back at you! No! What are you doing? Now I can't move! Old Peachy Carnahan uh, seems to know what to do. Oh no. Oh, are you kidding me right now? Please, please be kidding me right now. He should be right here. We should be able to see and talk to him right now. Ugh. Disgusting. Let's go get this dig spot then. And maybe I'll relog and come back and see uh, if he'll reappear. What a pain. What a huge pain. I wonder what you'll think about all this when you grow up. I wonder how much I'll tell you. Alright. Disposable safe cracker. Uh, the bicker bangers are worth a lot. That's about the only reason that I would grab one. And I still think we have plenty of canteens. If we go to my inventory... Uh, yeah, we've got 13 waters. And I thought, yeah, we have at least one canteen beside. So we should be alright on that. Okay, I'm gonna relog real quick, and then we'll head back over to the treehouse and see if that uh, resolves the issue. Hopefully, it will.
shit. Still only in Wellington Wells. Okay, let's go see. Let's go see what we can find out. I'm hoping that it was because I was being attacked. Uh, that he disappeared. I don't think they've quite got the hang of ambushing people. <laughs> ah. I always think I can hop onto that thing and then uh, get away with it, but it doesn't work out that way. We'll come back. Let's go around this guy. Oh, he's underneath. What are you doing down here? Can't you read? No girls allowed. Even if one of those girls is a secret agent? You're an agent of the Special Operations Executive? Prove it. <laughs> I've been inside Dr. Veloc's lair. Shh! Don't say that out loud. I've met Sergeant Stubbs. And I know what his favorite code is. Do you? All right, all right. You are a secret agent. That's right. Central needs Peachy to go on a secret mission. It's a very important, very dangerous mission behind enemy lines. Peachy? You can't expect me to let you take Peachy? I think we have to ask Peachy whether he wants to go or not. Don't we? He doesn't want to go, do you, Peachy? Oh. Oh. Well, that's very brave of you. <laughs> no, of course, Peachy. We all know there's a war on. Well, if we don't meet again, it's been an honor to command you. Safe travels, Peachy. He says he'll go with you. God be with you both. Ah, oh, that was easy. He didn't seem to mind at all. Well, I mean, he was he was annoyed at first, but in the end, he didn't mind. I wonder if he will buy some stuff from us, specifically these bricks or the spiky bricks or anything like that. See if we can do well, some bartering. I pop in to see what's new. That's right. Safe cracker. It's got healing bombs and stuff. We know how to craft most of that stuff, though. Okay. Um. Yeah, you pay a lot for the Molotovs. That's fine. Wow, bricks are worth eight? Are you kidding me? That's really good, though. Eighteen. Can sell some of those. Sick up tea. I'd prefer to use Nexamide anyway, so we'll sell some of that. Metal bits aren't very valuable. No surprise there. There we go. Nice, nice chunk of change. He's only got 91 left. How much do we have? 209? Good. Very good. And what else? Does he like drugs? Kind of. Okay, he's pretty good for sunshine. You know, as terrible as these berserk darts are, I think I will sell them to him because he's willing to pay a decent amount for them. Wow, he really likes antiseptic bandages. Only six for a full power cell? I think we have a bunch back at the base, though. In the pneumatic stash. Here, sell an empty torch to him. Oh, here we go. Okay. That ought to do Don't for now. Don't forget to file your report before you go back out there. Okay. Buy my report? What are you talking about? Let's go get ambushed. Isn't it right here? Left.
the very good food in here. Yep. Safe. Safe. Oh no! I didn't realize they just jumped straight in. Ow! That does hurt. that bright light over here? Oh, this is water, isn't it? This is a well of some kind. Uh, medicated balm? Do we have regular balms? We do. Let's just use a couple of these if we need to. Oh, that better healing perk really works out for us. not see me, my friend. You do not know I'm here. Oh, I almost walked straight over that. Okay. Well, in that case... And it would be great to throw this while he's standing there. That did not get him? How? Uh -huh. Oh, wrong one. Ah! I'm pretty sure there's more bombs around here, though. Oh, that's just cans right there. Oh, come on. so dumb. Why isn't it breaking the wire? You hear that? That should totally be breaking the wire. Okay. The tin cans I'm not worried about. It's the uh, explosives that I'm trying to avoid. Oh, I keep forgetting to unequip the stupid bottle first. Grief. One of these days I'll figure it out. Yep, as you were, gents. <laughs> Ah, oh, I fully expected him to come investigate his friend. That's fine, though. All right. Sorry. Baby needs new shoes. Yeah. Yeah, doing this for the baby shoes. Sure. Can't dig up these lilies for some reason. Cool. Now uh, we can get water here if we ever need to, which I'm not sure why we would, but uh, we can. Alright, let's go see if these psychopaths are out of here. We should be able to lower the food back down. I don't know if that's how it works or not, though. Oh, they're still stomping around in here. Uh, do we have any other way to deal with him? I don't think so. Let's see if we can draw them out somehow. No? Oh. Okay, he's seen me. Oops, I didn't mean to fall that far.
Whoa. Did he teleport outside up on top where I was? It looked like he did. Yeah, try it. You had this coming. That's right. I didn't want to. I didn't want to. Okay. Tea or... Let's do the grapefruit juice for right now. I guess I, I should have done tea because we are fighting here. Okay, there's two ladies. Or woman. Man, she's pretty good. She's a better fighter than that other guy was. Ow. Oh, come on. I right-clicked right there. They're gone, but they won't go away. Okay. Let's get our heal on. Perfect. Oh, where'd she go flying off to? Oh, there she is. Just an axe. No big deal. Alright, let's see if we can get a few good hits on her before she turns around. Ah, I I was clicking right click, I promise. She seems to hesitate a little bit before she actually blocks. There seems to be enough time for them to get an attack off. Sally, your customer relations leave something to be desired. <laughs> That's true. Okay. Now, if I remember correctly, there's absolutely nothing in here that we need. Did it. Inventory expansion, though. I didn't realize. Yeah, let's just take all this stuff. Sure. Rotten apples. Rotten meat, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Rotten carrots. Okay. Oh. Okay. Man, that was kind of messy. Very messy. Okay, Peachy has to go all the way back over to here. We could do a quick little explore around this area and then check out this dig spot here. It's kind of a northeasterly direction and then back around. Could chop down some more flash candies. So it appears the way that the uh, that one house was blockaded, the one where you're supposed to take mushrooms to get in, it appears that we're not going to have access to that house with Sally. Maybe we will in later on, and it will be unblockaded for that purpose, but the way it looked, we can't get in there, even if we do take mushrooms outside the gate. Wow. I could have swore I saw someone hanging from that tree. That's creepy, I guess, but... It's not like we haven't seen that in this game.
something going on over here. Another V1. Okay. Just a bunch of open wilderness, I guess. I don't know what I expected uh, to find out here, but I was honestly expecting a little bit more. A branch? You could just find branches on the ground around here? I didn't realize that. Creepy. It's getting to be daytime. That's kind of nice. I imagine we're getting tired by now, too. Explored most of this then. There should be structures over here where this dig spot is. There appeared to be buildings when we were looking at it before from a distance. Grab these while we can. Did I use that uh, inventory expansion kit? While I'm thinking about it, let's get that done. We have a very reasonable carry capacity now. Your grandmom didn't leave me a note. I never stopped wondering. Now why everyone but me? Didn't she care what happened to me? Head boys are gone now. What is this? Is this the magical yam? Oh. Yeah, see? That's what I said. It's not like you don't see people hanging in this game. This is not the way up. Now that it's daytime, too, I'll be surprised if I can get up here. Yam worshippers only, so this is the magic yam place. Oh. We need this more than you do. Oh, it's completely boarded up as well. Man. Sally doesn't get to do nearly as many of the fun activities as the others. Okay. Never mind about the structures, then. I thought there were buildings over here, but there are clearly not. Must have just been the mountain. Oh, man. I guess the torch and the stunt duck. We really don't need the canteen. Really, really. Okay. So that's pretty much everything that we needed around here. Uh, Peachy's final mission will do, but let's go to the witches. Yeah, 31%. I don't actually like long walks. Alright. Uh, can we make more sunshine? What are we low on? Flour? I think 10 more is probably plenty. Flash, I think we're okay on. Actually, I think we're okay on all the rest of this stuff. I just wanted more sunshine because we were down to like four. I wish I weren't such rubbish at tinkering. All right. Okay. And the stuff that it forgets about Let's go ahead and toss one of these in there. We can keep the other one. Pointy stick can go. Uh, I know we have rotten nonsense on us. Blue currants? No. Here. Rowan berries can go. Is a plasma? I mean, I'd like to keep one on us, maybe. Got rocks. Enhanced rocks. I wanted to sell those. Teacups can go. Um, let's see. We can make a hallucinogen. 
which I think is what we need for the Hallucinex atomizer. Yeah, we have 10 of these atomizers. There's another, there's another atomizer we need to make, isn't there? Sleep tight. What did sleep tight require? We don't have the recipe for that. Okay, hallucinogen is not what we need for the hallucinex atomizer. And we're going to need butterflies before we can make hallucinex. Let's make a couple of these. Okay. Phytosteroid, yams, alcohol, tea leaves. We need phytosteroid for a lot of other things, don't we? A lot of these. Blood toxin. Phytosteroid. We can make dexapam. That would be awesome. Beefy pituitary. So we need to take down a bobby, a willy, or a crier. And a doctor. Five. Sorry. Five of them. Five bobbies, five doctors. Five phytosteroids. Let's go ahead and make the phytosteroids that we can. We need more yams. So we'll have to get that accomplished at some time in the future. Alright. Come on. I gotta take those away. Good. So that was the hallucinex and the phytosteroids. Okay. Brilliant. Let's uh, do some loading, I guess. Okay. Doctor Faraday. <laughs> yes. And we know that's a recording, too, because it's been reported by a few of the things that we picked up. wonder what the witches think about me being on drugs coming up here. We'll see. Did you say the prayer? Indeed. I sort of feel stronger, actually. I think I can actually carry a bit more. You can't prove it's magic, though. What if it's psychosomatic? So what if it is? You're still feeling stronger. I'd rather you taught me about herbs. I need them. For the drugs I have to make. Patience. You are close to the learning you seek. Our hinge has been occupied. The old stone circle. The wedding party stones. There's ancient power there. The uh -huh. sacred circle has been polluted. Oh no. If you can clear it, then we'll teach you about the herbs you need. Wonderful. Well, that sounds sort of fun and righteous. Why not? Okay. Travel to the wedding party stones. Fine. I have a feeling that's probably closer than Peachy. It is. Uh, not by much, but it's closer. We'll run straight over there. Maybe we should have made some more flesh, because I have been eating them like candy. We're going to need to take a sleep here pretty soon, too. Because we are very low on fatigue. I guess tea helps with that a little bit, but not a whole lot. Is this just an abandoned house? Yeah. Now I haven't, I haven't been looking around. There's something over here, though. Just uh, another crumpled shack, it looks like. Almost exactly like the one we were just in. Only rotated. <laughs> oh, Jimmy Bar? That's alright. Oh, come on.
I haven't paid attention to this other side though. There's a big open field, so there could be anything in there. I see lights and trees. Oh, we have to be here at night. Pick some flowers. And all those loony folk are dancing around the flowers. We'll look into that. It's fairly close to the fast travel thing, so we should be able to get there in a decent amount of time. Oh no, I was sure I was going to find a way through the center of those. Okay. Do you think it's sweet enough? Why don't you taste it? <laughs> Seriously, you won't die from just a smidge. It'll just make everything burn a little brighter, is so all. Back at the house, we'll give everybody a huge cup of it. It doesn't hurt when we free our souls from their fleshy prisons, does it? I think your heart what? races for a bit, and then off we go to the ethereal flame, huh? Why don't we use hemlock? Like how Socrates killed himself. Hemlock doesn't hurt at all. My god. Uh, it's not what I've heard. They're brewing poison. Because we already made two big batches of ditch snacks. Can you imagine if we came back to the Reverend Father with a big bowl of hemlock now? He'd laugh at us. He might not even let us come along on the sacred journey. <laughs> I'll just keep stirring Suicide cult. All our questions will be answered once we're no longer in the prison of our bodies. Mm -hmm. That's what he said, right? It's some sort of suicide cult. I'm not going to let them poison a whole bunch of people. Now I've got to get rid of this poison. Oh. I guess it's none of my bit. I didn't know where else to go. I'm sorry. Did he lock you out? You're here for Rue, I imagine. Rue? Why the hell would I need Rue? She's not... That's an abortifacient. Oh. I'm not pregnant. I, I can't be. Joy's a contraceptive. The regular kind is. Oh, God. I'm such an idiot. You have a lot to think about. If you keep it... Then we'll help you as much as we can. You'll need to be very brave, dear. Much braver than if you don't. Strange that she would remember that around a suicide cult. Very strange. Okay, so what are we supposed to do here? Collect the poison. I don't think they'll just allow me to walk up and do that. I didn't kill anybody. Can't prove it. Just the one that saw me it appears to be. Oh no. Oh. Man, they can attack from so far away, too. Wow, are you kidding me? Come on, I pressed it. There we go. And that's for 
telling lies about me after school. That's right. Okay. Let's try this again. If we can. Okay. That didn't work out. Not being quite as sneaky as I was before, but uh, we're making some progress though. I'm probably gonna need some more medicated bombs pretty soon. Okay, I'll try not to. I don't. I don't even like this place. Who's gonna clean that up? It's a good question. Man, I'm not even phased by that thing anymore. When I first uh, first started using it, it was really strange. Now I really don't mind. I don't need it, but I'll take the mushroom. I don't think we need any of that for sure. Okay. Big creep. I think it's hilarious. He says, can't kill us all, and that's exactly what they're trying to do with their little poison suicide deal sacred journey sorry excuse me well you're not my problem I guess that's right <laughs> okay choir's canteen are you kidding me right now I did all of this. Gotta be kidding me. Oh, my nose needs a bath. Let's do us a quick sleep. Yep. We'll fight better now. That's good. Oh, ridiculous. So ridiculous. Let's um let's empty out first. There we go. Now let's grab an empty canteen. Or two, sure. Let's make us uh a flash. Okay. Come on. That's it, right? Squaring the circle. Pretty sure. Need a canteen. Ridiculous. How many times has that happened to me in this uh, second act? Too many times. It's strange what the pneumatic stash counts as crafting materials, canteens being one of them, and rotten fruits and vegetables not being, when there's so many uh, good foods that people can use. All right, now we go back to the witches. Okay. 
I bet the toasted chicory gives us a bunch of extra stamina too. Probably should have gone with that instead, since it's more like coffee. Let's also get our food up. There we go. Now we should be able to run for a good long time. It's too bad that we have to have heels and we can't make uh, trainer shoes to help us run faster. Yeah, we're close enough now I don't think it's quite worth it to pop another flash. But our travel time is pretty, uh, pretty nice though. One who is three comes near. Three who are one awaits. One who is... huh. One who is three? The people there. They were wearing these sigils. Oh lord. The space god people. Ransom Mackenzie's congregation in Gardner House. They were making... digital acts? In small amounts, it's a drug. More than that, it's a poison. You can make it from red foxglove seeds. We oh make all sorts of useful potions and things out of it. You could, too. I think their Reverend Father is planning for the whole lot of them to kill themselves. I can think of a lot of reasons to kill yourself in the Garden District. But no one should have their death chosen for them. You know about my mum? I remember there was a terrible accident. Your mum put the wrong herbs in the family dinner. The whole family died except you. It was just before the train, so I always wondered. It wasn't an accident, was it? Mm. I think she didn't want my sisters to be scared. All alone in Germany. So she killed them. And I guess she didn't want Dad to hate her. So she killed him too. And she couldn't live with herself. I don't know why she left me behind. Here. This is the recipe for digital axe and something more. Mix it into their poison, and it should change from poison to mm, let's call it an eye opener. <laughs> You'll need digital axe for that, among other things. Come back, and I'll have the rest of what you need. You're making a sort of herbal blackberry joy, aren't you? You know your chemistry. I was on Harry Hayworth's team when we invented joy. One day I hope the goddess will forgive me for that. Wow. Digital Lax Antidote, Digital Lax, and Sleep Tight. All available in the journal now. I think that's where we're going to leave it for this episode, though. Let's see if we can buy... Wow, 21 points. Yes, we can buy. Let's get this one. And then how much is this now? 15? And we only have 9? 10, 10. 8. 10. So we probably ought to save this for either this one or uh, this one. Probably this one first, though. Get the uh, basic price. Hmm. We'll see. Anyways, if you want to catch the next episode, be sure to subscribe. Consider supporting my channel through the Patreon link down in the video description. And feel free to check out any of my other videos or playlists that you might be interested in. I thank you so much for all the time you spend on my channel. And I hope blessings of wisdom and peace on all of you. Farewell.